Okay, we are back. So um, this is another uh, short indie horror game that I found. It's called Low Frequency, and you can see it's made by Anjin16. Um, so let us get into it. We'll see. I wonder if this is going to be as short as the other one. <laughs> Okay, so we're on a boat. And everything looks weird. It's a bird! Hi, are you a seagull? I don't, I don't like seagulls, they're annoying. Okay, so apparently with this game, you, there was an accident, like a shipwreck or something like that, and then basically we're, I think we're just in the ocean trying to survive. It's kind of like a, a stranded deep type situation, you know, cast away, all that jazz. Because I've right. Sorry, I thought I heard something. I literally have no food or anything. I literally just have a radio and a bird. I guess I could eat him. Uh, okay, let's... Uh-huh. Which will lead you to higher ground. Please proceed in a quest. Oh. If you have children at school, do not attempt to pick. Oh, it's a catastrophe as in, like, there's been a huge, like, global flood. Okay. Can I turn it off? I don't like that. It's all clear. Everything's underwater, like, I don't think anything's going to be all clear. Okay, alright, so it seems like there's been a global flood. More of a Noah's Ark type situation. Uh, hey, Mr. Bird, are you my only friend? Uh, should I name you? Ralph? Is that a good name for a bird? Ralph? Please don't leave me, Ralph. Uh... I, I genuinely don't know what to do. <laughs> I guess it, this is going to be another one of those death simulators, right? Just waiting for death. Uh, uh, oh, the sky's red. It's got like the big circular thing like in Skyrim when you look up in Sovereign Guard or the Soul Cairn. Is this the, is this the Soul Cairn? <laughs> uh, so, Ralph, uh, you had a good day? Oh shit, everything's getting dark. Ralph, please don't leave me. I'm scared. <laughs> We're sailing towards civilization. Ralph, you're still here with me. Good. Okay. Wow. It's a pretty good animation. <laughs> so. Oh, hello. Uh. You're, you're kind of weird looking, sorry, don't want to judge you, but... Oh, hi, um, how are you doing? Uh, that, this is my bird friend, Ralph. Let's, uh, talk to this guy, Marcus. Hi, Marcus, how are you doing? You're very tall, or I'm very short. Hello, stranger. Welcome to our town. Looks like you've had a long journey. We haven't seen many people around here. And you can rest in the room on the right. Oh, cheers, Mark. Uh, us. Alright, could you not, like, stare at me like that? I don't really like that. That's kind of disturbing. Alright, I'll see you later, Ralph. I'm gonna go to sleep, because I'm very tired. Uh, please keep an eye on that guy. I don't trust him. He, um... Oh, hello. Another human being. Who are you? Oh, you're even... Do you know what? This woman is even creepier than that guy. Like... Hi, I'm Eva. Do you feel good? You look very tired. After the arrival, anyone would feel that way. Uh, yeah, what, uh, Slender, the arrival? Is that is that a game? Or was it, uh, anyway. Uh, is this your house? Wait, okay, he said on the right. That's, this isn't the right. This is the left. Uh, can I go in your house? Are you gonna kill me if I go in here? Uh, what is this? Is this a generator? A barrel? Okay. I gotta say, this this game has more of a kind of build-up than the last one. It's definitely kind of creeping me out, these people. Um, uh, okay, uh, I'll talk to you first, just because you're closer. Uh, okay, you're not quite as creepy as the others. Um, just, I don't know, more weird-looking. Welcome, buddy. Feel free to roam the town. 
You can stay uh, as long as you want. Uh, well, I don't, I don't really want to stay here. I just don't really feel that I have a choice. Can I run? Uh, really don't like the way that everyone just stares at me. Allison. Uh, okay, no offense. I would not have guessed you were a woman. Um, how is this possible? We thought there was nothing left. Anyway, we're happy that you uh, to have a visitor. Make yourself at home. Okay, can I go in your house then? Is that what you mean? Ooh, just two mattresses. Okay, this radio doesn't work, but then again, seeing as the last radio, I, I, I don't really care that it doesn't work, to be perfectly honest. Okay, I think they said that this is my room. Oh, here's another person. Uh, hi, you actually look slightly more normal. Uh, Stacy? That's a weird way of spelling Stacy. Have you heard? We will not have a victory. Uh, wait, what? What did you say? Oh, okay. I can't talk to you again. We won't have a victory, apparently. I don't I don't know what that means, but... Maybe it means that this we won't be able to sort out this situation. Huh? Hmm. I thought I could hear something. That was weird. Uh, so this is my room, yeah? There's a hammock. I'm gonna explore the rest of the, uh, the, the town. I don't think there's much more to see, but... Just, just in case. Just in case... I don't know. Uh, hello, Jacob. How did you get here? The water is too cloudy. Did you hear the signal? You shouldn't pay attention. I shouldn't pay attention. What, to the signal? The one that said that, like, basically everyone's dead? Um, and that there's no hope for humanity? Or maybe it said, watch out for these freaky bastards. If you see a bloody town floating in the middle of the ocean, just roll on by, honestly. John. Looks like today wasn't a good day. You should go to sleep a little. Why does everybody really want me to sleep? Is that so that they can, like, kill me and eat me or something? I mean, there doesn't seem to be any food here. Like, unless you're gonna fish out of the ocean, I guess, but then... I don't know what this catastrophe did, like... Oh, I think... I didn't go in there, did I? Oh, well, we have... Oh, we have a toilet. That's nice. It's, again, it's just a barrel. But then again, why wouldn't we just piss and shit in the ocean? Like, no offense. Like, it's it's gonna get carried off somewhere. I mean, I'm not for polluting, you know, the world's oceans and stuff, but I'm pretty sure after this catastrophe that there's, there's probably worse things we could do. Alright, I'm gonna close my door. Nobody come in. I'm sleeping. Okay, let me check over here. Oh, I got... Ah, uh, great. It's gonna get dark. So let me guess, I go to sleep, and then something wakes me up in the middle of the night, and I start looking around the town. Okay, let's go to sleep. Uh, guys, I, I want to go to sleep. Please? Why can't I sleep? You just said, go to sleep, I'm... <sighs> I okay, I'm a little bit confused. Um... Okay, guys, you said I could sleep, but I, I, I don't know how to sleep. Maybe, maybe this is my room. No. What the shit? What's going on? Maybe this guy doesn't know his lefts from his rights. Maybe it wasn't here. Although I didn't see a bed. Just sleep on the generator. What does this say? Oh, it's a radio. There's loads of radios here. I, I guess that's all we really care about. To be perfectly honest, if I was here, I wouldn't want to sleep either, because this place is creepy. Am I just supposed to, like, stand on it? <laughs> Ah, sleep. Come to me. Ah, fuck's sake. A few minutes later. I hate being stuck on... on things. Unless they mean... I don't know, do they mean like... Maybe they mean in here. Maybe, maybe this is... What they... Oh. Right. Dude, that... Forget it. I'm not even gonna bother. I don't understand how this is the right. This is literally like, straightforward. Anyway. Oh. Oh. Hi, guys. Turn off the radios. Oh, sugar. Okay, that's... Why is it in every horror game you have to have, like, the worst torch ever? The door's locked. 
Jesus Christ, guys, can you turn off your radios, honestly? Like, it's very... We're all trying to sleep. Although I don't know where the flippin' hell Marcus is. Hi, guys. Sorry to wake you. I'm just turning off your radios because, you know, you're all very inconsiderate. I, I might go check on Ralph. Yo, Ralph. You doing okay, Ralph? <gasps> oh, no! My boat is gone! Oh, no, it isn't. <gasps> but Ralph is gone. Ah, oh, what? Ralph, why did you leave? Well, actually, to be perfectly honest, oh, I can jump. Nice. I don't, I don't blame him. Whoa, what is that? There's... Why is there a radio tower in the middle of the ocean? Wait, there's... Whoa, there's loads of them. I didn't notice that. Oh. Ha! <laughs> I'm s Okay. Uh. Oh, no. I literally just fell in the ocean. What the fuck is it? Uh. Hello, guys? Um. Can I restart? <laughs> Um, why can I just fall in the ocean and it doesn't- I can still turn on my flashlight. Okay, uh, sorry guys, uh, just bear with me a moment, let me just- I think I'm gonna have to exit the game and, like, try again. Later that night. Okay, this is where I got to before, where I fell in the ocean. Okay. There's still one. Sorry, I was, I was commenting on the radio towers before the fact that I didn't see them. Because... I, I think that they definitely weren't there before. Where is this last one? Hi guys. Hope you're sleeping well. Okay. If somebody starts chasing me, I'm gonna fall in the water, aren't I? <laughs> Well, ugh, I'm definitely feeling pretty tired. I think I'm going to go back to bed. Okay, nighty-night, everyone. Sleep tight. Don't get murdered by a diabolical entity. Especially one of eldritch origin. Oh, oh, oh what, a, what a lovely night's sleep I had. I uh, definitely didn't shit and piss myself uh, multiple times throughout the night. Oh, people are actually walking around now. That's disconcerting. Uh, can, can you go back to just standing around in one place? I just, I don't like the fact that you guys can move around. It makes me think that you're probably going to chase me. I think today is a good day. Something I still don't understand why the sun hasn't risen. Oh, that's... Yeah, yeah, because the, the sky is, like, orange. It's kind of weird, like, there, a number of years ago, or maybe, well, I don't know, like, maybe about three years ago or something, there was a day which was, like, the sky was orange because there was, like, a bunch of dust that had been picked up, I think, in, like, the sort of Sahara Desert or something like that, and it had been thrown into the atmosphere, and basically, like, when I was walking around, walking to work, it was, the sky was literally this kind of colour, and then the sun... You could literally just see the kind of, um, I can't remember what the ring's called, the ring of light around the sun. Um, but it was, it was really creepy, it literally did look like Doomsday. Oh, it's you, looks like you're awake, boy. I hope you slept well. The weather forecast seems to show proximity of a rare rain. I recommend that you sleep. Dude, I literally just got up, I don't want to go back to sleep, and also, could you guys, like, maybe turn off your radios? You know, before you go to bed, because it's it's really inconvenient for me to have to run around. Anyway. Uh, is it, does anybody else want to have a chat with me? Okay, now they're just standing around again. That's weird. Hi, Alison, who kind of looks like an old man. That night was very noisy. Did you hear the radio? Yeah, I did. I, I was the only one that thought... Wait, what? what? No, the radio doesn't even work. What the fuck are you talking about? There's something in the sea making noise. Lady, you're surrounded by the ocean. It could be a whale, it could be a fucking... merman, I don't know. But the radios were definitely on. I literally got up to turn them off. Hi, Stacy. What? What the fuck did you just say? I didn't even get a chance to read that. Anyway, whatever. Screw you, Stacy. I don't... Oh, hi. I thought this was my room. Wait, why do you get the hammock and we all have to sleep on dirty mattresses on the floor? 
between three people. Why do you get your own room, Lucas? I've been thinking about the arrival. It really was unavoidable. Although it's the best thing that could happen to the world. The arrival of what? Cthulhu? I wouldn't be surprised if Cthulhu was in this game, to be perfectly honest. This game is kind of giving me Lovecraftian vibes. Um, where are the fish people? Where's, you know, Urgathoth or whatever he's called? Or, um, I do have a, a H.P. Lovecraft book. It's uh, like a collection of all his stories. It's really good. I've been reading it for a while, and I'm still not even halfway through it. <laughs> uh all right, fine. I'm going back to bed because apparently this is my life. Oh, I didn't realize I had my torch on that whole time. If they don't have to find batteries. Oh, it's raining. God, is there not? There's already an. Oh, where is everybody? Oh, okay. The the flashlight seems to be a lot better now. Torch, flashlight, whatever you want to call it. I call it a torch most of the time, but. Uh, oh no, they're T-posing. They're T-posing. <laughs> Hi, Stacy. Have you heard that the bird is the word? He will not have a victory. Is weird. Yeah, that was weird. The sound just cut out. Who will not have a victory? Sorry, are you talking about God? Are you talking about... I mean, I'm an atheist, so... You're kind of barking up the wrong tree where that's concerned. Right. Marcus, are you here? Okay, there's somebody else T-posing. Is everybody T-posing? Okay, oh, what the hell's going on with you, dude? You've gone 3D. Welcome, buddy. Feel free to roam the town. You something. Okay. Yeah, the sound keeps cutting out, that's weird. Huh? Why is everybody going 3D? How is this possible? We thought there was nothing left. Anyway, we're happy there is a visitor. Make yourself at home. Why is everybody saying the same thing that they said before? And why is everything 3D? This isn't Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Well, actually, wait. Shark Boy gonna like jump out of the ocean and kill me? Don't kill me, Taylor Lautner. Twilight wasn't that bad, I guess. Ava. Yeah, Ava. I, I didn't see you yesterday, Ava. Do you feel good? After the arrival, blah blah blah. Okay, I think. I think everything's getting even more 3D as, as, as the game progresses. Does that mean my bird's back? Is, is Ralph back? Marcus, what the hell is going on? Why is everybody 3D? Why are you awake? I told you to sleep. You shouldn't be here. You've seen. We are able to save them all. Since we arrived, the world has become chaos. There's no one else here. You are the only living person in the world. I can't let you leave this place. You better run. Okay. I'm running. I don't know why. Um, okay, everybody's gone. Uh, I'm going to go back to bed, Marcus. You don't have to murder me. Everything's fine. <sighs> I'm going to die. Okay, maybe if I just go in the, the toilet... Okay, dude, Marcus, you, you, you're giving me mixed signals here, man. Okay, everything's... Can I just go to the toilet? <clears throat> oh, shit, hi. Oh, whew, geez. That did make me jump. Can I just jump in the ocean and get it over with? Okay, uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to escape this guy. Should I just run into him and let him kill me? Because, uh, okay, the generator... Okay, can I get in my boat, maybe? Ralph, help! Oh, no, I can't go that way. Ah, oh, he's gonna get me. He's gonna get me! Ralph. Ralph, help. Um. Help me, radio. Radio, radio Gaga. Radio Goo Goo. What the fuck is going on? Yeah, I, I think I can hear him behind me. Or, oh, I don't fucking know. <laughs> All right, this game's kind of freaking me out now. I maybe I got to turn on the radios. I'm just going to turn the radios on. 
Uh, Marcus, are you there? The game is very dark. Turn the radios on. Uh, Marcus? Fuck. Oh. <laughs> uh, sorry, Marcus. Oh. Oh, no, he's just 3D. So he's stuck in there. Am I just supposed to let him get me? Okay, um... Ugh. Oh, Jesus. God, it is so hard to see anything now. Um... Okay, the... Right, well, there wasn't a... There was a radio on my boat, but I don't think I can get there. Oh, Ralph! Ralph is back! Ralph, help! Why won't you let me go on my boat? Uh, I think I just gotta let Marcus get me. I mean, I wouldn't do this in real life. I'd be on that boat. I don't I don't think I had any paddles, but... Fine, Marcus, you can kill me. But Marcus... Wait, he shot me? If that's all he was gonna do, I mean... Final... Duh. The end. Okay. Yeah, that game was alright. It was uh, it was actually quite interesting. Um, I mean, I don't really know what to say. Like, I mean, I played it for like about half an hour, uh, mainly because I fell in the ocean and whatever. I mean, th there wasn't like a whole lot to it. It was obviously just meant to be like there's some catastrophe and then you basically end up in this weird place with these weird people and I guess it kind of turned out that you were the last person alive and he was some sort of entity trying to... I don't know if he caused the catastrophe or if he just kind of wanted you to kind of join all the other people in death. I, I, I don't know. But yeah, it was it was quite creepy. I mean, obviously there were a few bugs like that he got caught on the door and stuff and uh, I don't know whether there's like... It said final D. I don't, I don't, I don't know... If that means maybe there was like multiple endings, I mean there probably aren't, but who knows? Uh, obviously, I'll link this in the uh, description, and obviously you can check it out yourself if you want to. But yeah. So anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Ciao.